everybody and welcome to my March unboxing video. I've only got one prize to unbox today. I haven't been doing so well this month so far, but mostly because I haven't really been entering as many. So let me get down to it and it's a very nice prize. Today's date is the 8th of March and the prize that I have won is this gorgeous basket of goodies from Basket Galore. Baskets Galore. Um, basically, each month they do a competition on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter where you like and share every day, or as many days as you can during the week. Their baskets that they've made and their baskets are lovely um, so I actually enjoy like looking at their baskets and seeing what's in each day so you basically share it and then each month at the uh, um, end or the next month they pick a day and from that day they pick a winner from Instagram a winner from Twitter and a winner from Facebook and I am lucky after entering for quite a long time to win this lovely basket so i'm actually going to unbox it now right here so let's see what we have got i've got my table here so oh you kind of almost don't want to open this because it's so lovely like ribbon and lovely presented so there's a bit of ribbon so i actually will be keeping these ribbons because uh my stepmom enjoys crafting and so she might like to use them. Right, let me have a little look and see what's inside here. First off, we have some matcha truffles. Green tea praline truffles with a liquid centre. Mmm, this tastes sound amazing so that's what we have first and then let's just open it a little bit more we have some ooh la la tea biscuits yummy coconut cookie ooh la la <laughs> I like the name of them ooh la la and then we have some dark chocolate apple sticks. Yeah. What do they taste like? Only 115 calories. Mm, have to try them. Never tried them before. And we have some tea, specialised tea. SD Bell and Co. Belfast tea. No, that's lovely. And oh, some veggie crisps. Crispy green beans. Veg crisp. Some dark chocolate. Sea dog. Sea dog with lime and sea salt. Ooh, very nice. You're right, Jack. There's nothing here for you, I'm afraid. Shindigs, rocking Irish roots, little hand cooked crisps. They look cool. <laughs> and oh, oh yes, shortbread. My favourite. I love shortbread. So I shall be definitely tucking into that. And finally, some caramel fingers, which I'm going to take down to my sister's in a minute when I go down. I love these, you know, caramel, chocolate, yum, yum, yum. So that was brilliant. So thanks very much to Baskets Galore. Also, you get a lovely basket to keep and use. So that's great. Thanks to Baskets Galore. Um, that is all for now, but hopefully there'll be more later on in the month. Thanks for watching.
bye hello everybody today's date is the 29th of march and due to the recent news about coronavirus i have been very slackish on comping i don't know why just haven't really felt in the mood to do comps but hoping to get back into it um i know there's probably quite a lot less comps around anyway at the moment but gonna keep going but i do have four prizes to share with you but before that i just want to say i hope everyone is well stay safe and just take care of yourself and your family okay at the moment i've also got my sister and niece here so if you hear anything that's because they're here and obviously the dog we're all in isolation together playing board games and stuff like that just trying to keep ourselves occupied right let's get on with the prizes so yeah today's date is the 29th of march and here is my first prize it's a package now I have started opening stuff uh, because what I've been doing is opening things and then putting them on the sideboard for two to three days before I touch them again because I'm super conscious about getting this coronavirus as I have asthma. So here's my first one. Now this one is coming from Voucher Codes. Hang on, let me just get into the jiffy and then I'll give, show you more. Um, I won this for my children's charity appeal which you know if you've seen previous videos basically where i'm any children's prizes i'm keeping and then at the end of the year i will be donating them to a children's charity or somebody who needs presents for their children at christmas hopefully um and yeah thanks for it so much for entering our competition this was on twitter from voucher codes we hope you love your new books and they are i love it that they wrapped it up it's like my birthday which happens to be on the 18th of april that's going to be a fun birthday and they are you basically have to they were giving away a lot of box sets of books you had to choose your favorite one for kids and i chose what were probably one of my favorite books as a kid the Secret Seven books by Enid Blyton and they are just great. Love them. So that is going to go to someone. Blimey, there's quite a lot of books in there. So <laughs> that's really, really good. And I'm sure they'll really enjoy reading those. Someone will, like I did. So thank you very much to Voucher Codes on Twitter. Slight game there. Can you name the Secret Seven? No. Oh. <laughs> I can name the famous five. We are the famous five. Julian, Dick and Anne, George and Timmy the dog. Right. Sorry for the interruption. That's okay. Right, next up is a little, what do you call this? Oh, envelope. <laughs> what do you call this? It's an envelope. And in here, this has come from Tire Pros on Facebook. It was a like and share competition and they gave, I think it was 10 winners, £10 love to shop vouchers. And there it is. So that would be cool to spend in various places when everything reopens. Uh, hopefully it's valid for a fair time. Um, it probably is. Anyway, oh yeah, the 30th of the 9th, 2021. What year are we in? 2020. 2020 so yeah that would be fine that's over a year that's over a year so we will be using that there's a little hole in there is there supposed to be a hole in there there's a hole in my bucket dear lila dear lila right anyway that's that right next come oh i've got a stretch ah, ah. right sorry about that that sounded like some kind of oh ah, Eight or something going on there. Right, monkey. Right, this is from the Soho Soap Company on Facebook. And I think they picked about five winners for this for Mother's Day, um, which has gone past, but I shall be sharing this with my mum and sister. Oh, there's a pr little price list, a little bit of what they do. So in here, oh, it smells delicious. 
there is a little cute little Soho company it, soap company towel and then we have oh that smells delightful a bath bomb I'm not going to get it out because it might get a bit messy and then we have some rose shampoo Joe Riley, that went right up my snout. <coughs> That's that one. And then we have what's this one? Jasmine conditioner. Mmm, smells nice. It's like a little bar. Never used any of these like little bar type uh, shampoos and conditioners, but definitely worth giving a go. And then there's this one, which is a soap. Look at that soap. That looks amazing. I love it. Look, and that and smells delish, and my sister likes the tin. They're very cute. It says, first my mother, forever my friend, Soho Soap Company, on all the little tins, which are really cute. So thank you, thank you, thank you to the Soho Soap Company for that wonderful prize, which, again, I won on Facebook. And finally, my last prize, and probably my last prize of the month, because I haven't really been entering many, and I, I need to get back on it, because I kind of, like, miss them coming through. They obviously, you know, a lot of companies are closed at the moment, is this. And this is probably my favourite prize. Is there something else in there? No. Of the year so far. This is absolutely stunning. And this is a picture of my dog, Jack, hand-drawn by the very incredibly talented Lucy Ann Artist on Instagram. Honest, when I saw this, I was just like gobsmacked at how amazing it is. So, uh, uh, well, I'm going to get a frame for it because, I, as everybody knows, I absolutely love my little Jack Jack. I'm um, going to get a nice frame for it and treasure it forever so thank you very much to Lucianne artist on instagram go and check out her page because she does lots of great uh, drawings uh, with pencil and i'm just amazed because i was a bit worried that because he's a white dog that you wouldn't you know see what he looks like but with all the shadowing and shading it's just amazing i wish i had that talent i really do anyway so thank you very much to lucy ann artist um and that wraps up my march Probably, unless another one comes whizzing through, but I don't think I'm due much. Um, and boxing video. So thanks everyone for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and take care, stay safe, and bye for now. Bye.